Hey guys, so today I'm going to be reviewing the Dr. Barbara Sturm Brightening Skincare Line. And the products that I have in front of me today are the Brightening Serum and also the Brightening Face Lotion. So this is my second bottle of the mini serum. I've also purchased two full bottles of the regular size serum. And so technically this is my fourth bottle and I've also purchased... Uh, brightening face lotion before so this is my second bottle and I've also purchased the brightening face cream I don't have the brightening face cream with me because I've used it up during the winter time let's talk about what gravitated towards me or what gravitated me towards this line well one I have normal skin I don't suffer from acne I do suffer from hyperpigmentation and dark spots um, my skin does have heavy melanin so um, the sun gets me, uh, when I'm out in the sun, even if I wear sunscreen, I'm really prone to getting some sunspots and um, some dark, dark spots as well. Or if a pimple decides to show up here and there, it leaves me a nice little dark mark, which I have to then take care of. So I don't really wear a lot of makeup and the only thing that I'm wearing right now is concealer and mascara and obviously I've filled in my brows and I have some lip gloss on, but I really don't like wearing makeup. So I, want to, I wanted to find a line to help me even out my skin tone, fade my dark marks and just make me feel confident um, without wearing any makeup. And this line has done that for me. So to start off with her serum, this serum contains crust sprouts, which helps uh, brighten your skin overall. It also contains ginseng as extract, which is really good for fighting free radicals. And then it also has hyaluronic acid in it, which is very, very important because hyaluronic acid really helps hydrate your skin and even if you have oily skin you need to hydrate your skin so I can definitely appreciate this so the texture of this serum is that it's creamy right it's not water-based this is how it looks it kind of looks uh, a little bit pink but uh, not to fear, it doesn't uh, leave any pink marks. It blends into your skin beautifully. And I wanted to kind of leave it on here because it is not very runny, as you can see. Um, it's not her typical um, water-based serums. It is light in weight. And I'm going to go ahead and show you that by rubbing that in. You can also pat it into your skin, like so. And the... The thoughts on this serum, and I know I've already tried it and I've definitely used it, but it's not sticky. It's um, very light and it blends into your skin beautifully. It gives you a nice little sheen, gives you a very much so healthy glow. Not sure if you guys can see that on camera, but this hand definitely looks uh, better than the other one. And I'll just go ahead and switch them around so you guys can see from the lighting perspective as well. This serum is truly amazing. It it has really helped my skin. I've seen not uh, any shade lighter in my face, but I've just seen an overall radiant glow. I've seen dark spots minimized. Um, and again, it takes time. You're not going to see it from the first use. You definitely do need to be more consistent with this. A tip that I really love with this serum is you can kind of use it anywhere on your body. So I had this burn mark on my shoulder um, that I got from when I was curling my hair and I actually put this on here and with consistent usage and after a couple of weeks I noticed that that mark was getting lighter and lighter which I was super happy about. Another thing that I really like with this serum is I actually use it underneath my eyes as a, an eye primer, if you will, um, before applying my concealer on top. And I did that today, and I'm sure you could still see my dark circles peeking through because I'm wearing a very light concealer, but this makes my eyes feel so hydrated. And this seems to be a real big problem for me because I use eye cream, I use face cream, you, you know, I use all of that stuff, but my eyes can never get enough hydration. So this definitely, definitely helps. It keeps me um, looking really good 
like I said, I, I definitely love the tip of putting this underneath my eyes and you only need a little bit of this serum. I know I used a lot when I had it on my hand right here, but honestly, you just need one drop of this and one drop is actually really good for my entire face and down to um, my neck and uh, parts of my decollete. So that's one thing that you're going to get with this serum is definitely the quality is 100% there. You only need to use a little bit. Moving on to the brightening face lotion. So I'm using this because it's the summertime. I didn't want a heavy moisturizer and I tend to use this in the morning times um, right before applying my sunscreen. This face lotion is amazing and I'm going to show you because I'm going to put it on top of the brightening serum and you can see it's um, it's uh, not a gel moisturizer which I love. It's a uh, it's very light in weight. I, I barely can feel it on, on my skin right now. And now when I blend it in, I can tap it in or I can rub it in. And I really wanna rub it in to show you that the brightening serum, you see nothing's pilling. And that's what I really love about it. I really love the fact that it blends into your skin beautifully. It gives you a nice glow um, it suck or it sinks right into your skin, but it leaves you feeling hydrated. And that's the most important thing, feeling hydrated. With this um, base lotion, obviously there's crust sprouts in there, there's ginseng extract, there's, um, there's hyaluronic acid, and there's also vitamin E, which vitamin E is definitely Im important. Um, with uh, keeping your skin healthy, helping it uh, fight for free radicals. This face lotion has definitely saved me um, or saved my skin. I, I also use it on my body as well. So after I had that burn mark with the serum, I also put a little bit of face lotion on my um, shoulder for where I had it. And it, it's just honestly done wonders. So for this line, if you're contemplating on what line is right for you, if you suffer from hyperpigmentation and you wanted to only purchase one product, I would say go ahead and go for the brightening serum. And if you're, um, if you're concerned with the price, obviously it's very expensive. I would say go ahead and wait for a Sephora sale because sometimes you can save any, anywhere between 10 to 20% off based on your um, membership tier or a check out a beauty counter to get a sample or just DM them on Dr. Barbara Storm's in Instagram and they'll give you a sample. Um, I highly recommend checking it out, especially if you suffer from hyperpigmentation. Just remember it's going to come with consistent, consistent usage. You're definitely going to see results. You're going to definitely see a nice, beautiful glow in your skin. And um, hopefully, you know, you'll be feeling more confident just as this has given me confidence. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching.